Christmas gifts. Don't buy me what I don't want. Is it okay to let others know what you want and what you don't want? Hello, y'all. I'm Diana Brienne. Well, I got to thinking about Christmas gifts and letting others know what we don't want and possibly what we do want. Is that okay? Well, I think it depends upon the relationship. If it's someone that we don't know very well, and let's say it's somebody that we work with in the office, um, probably it's not okay, in my opinion, to go up to them and tell, tell them what we don't need or what we do need, because it's kind of a more um, impersonal relationship. But I'm talking about people that we're really close to, like our spouses, um, our adult children, or maybe our children might tell us what they want. Um, people that we're really close to, I feel it's perfectly okay to let them know what we don't want. It's not meaning that we're not being grateful because gratitude um, is actually, um, you know, it's a form of saying thank you for the thought of you giving me a gift in the first place. So if someone gave me a gift and then I didn't like it or didn't want it, I would still be grateful that they gave me a gift, okay? And yet, the, I think to avoid that situation where someone gives us what we don't want, I think sometimes the best thing that we can do is let them know what we don't want. And, you know, like my adult children tend to buy me things to put on the wall. And so this year I told them, I said, hey, you know what, um, this is what I really do need and I prefer, I don't need any more of these, okay? And the same way with them. I wanna know what they really want. Now, of course, when we let other people know, we need to remember that we need to keep it within what they plan on budgeting um, to spend for us. So in other words, we don't wanna go ask for a brand new car when they were gonna give us a $25 gift, okay? So we have to keep things in mind when we're, we're letting people know what we don't want and what we do want. And yet I believe in being grateful. It's the thought that counts. It's the thought that matters when it comes to um, gift giving. And yet we want people to, to know that we're grateful. And yet if possible beforehand, what we really would like. Because often people want to know what you want, but they don't know what you want and they're trying to figure it out. And sometimes it can be very helpful by letting people know what we do want, what what we would, what we're lacking maybe is, I don't know if that's a right word, but something that we would prefer to have over something else. And like I said, this is with people that are close to us that we can have that kind of conversation with, um, perhaps in an office setting or a neighbor or somebody like that, that would not be appropriate or maybe even with a friendship. It might not be appropriate. It depends upon the level of the friendship. So for me, I let my family know what I, I would prefer and what I wouldn't prefer. And yet, regardless of what they give me, I'm grateful. From my house to yours, may God bless you. I hope you like, share, subscribe. And I hope to talk to you soon again. Bye-bye.